This is Brother Barnes and we're doing a mock practical on the bones and bone features. This is the breastbone right in the middle and I'm asking you to tell me what is this upper portion 25 and then this hangy downy piece right at the bottom 26. Just number these in the comments below and tell me your answers. I also have the answers as I perceive them and there's a link in the description below the video where you can go and download those answers. Interestingly, there are some other features that can easily be seen here. I see the clavicle, I see the acromion, and so the, the joint created here is the AC joint right there. Notice that a number of the ribs, seven of these, have somewhat a direct connection back to the sternum. Those are called vertebrosternal or true ribs. You can see the coracoid process of the scapula. That's pretty easy to see. And notice the intertubercular groove on the humerus. There's the greater and the lesser tubercle of the humerus. Also, notice that between the vertebrae are the discs, and notice that there are transverse processes of the uh, vertebrae that poke out to the sides and serve as attachment points for muscles. By the way, the C6-ish disc in the neck, which is C6, C7, and then L4, L5 are the most common discs for problems and the main reason is that the, the hips are very reinforced just like the rib cage and when we go from a reinforced area to a highly mobile area then that area serves as a leverage point and can possibly create problems. Interesting. Keep coming back.